In 2008, the post-apocalyptic Pixar film WALL-E showed roaches as the only surviving creatures on a wasteland Earth. Mythbusters tested this theory in one episode, and the roaches did indeed survive longer than humans would. You know, this is crazy. This is the 10,000 rad. This is 10 times the lethal dose for humans, and look how many cockroaches are still kicking. However, cockroaches are not the most resilient species on Earth. Far from it. There's a microscopic creature that can survive temperatures as cold as absolute zero or as high as 300 degrees, up to 30 years without food or water. Extreme pressures, both high and low, air deprivation, radiation enough to kill a herd of elephants, and even several days in space. Meet the tardigrade, also known as water bear or moss piglet. These plump, waddling, eight-legged microorganisms are often found around mossy trees. However, they can be found in countless different environments, in the desert, on mountaintops, in rainforests. They live on all seven continents, too. Despite looking squishy, tardigrades are covered in a tough cuticle, similar to the exoskeletons of grasshoppers, praying mantises, and other insects to which they are related. Like those insects, tardigrades have to shed their cuticles in order to grow. They have four to six claws on each foot, which helps them cling to plant matter, and a specialized mouth part called a bucopharyngeal apparatus, which allows them to suck nutrients from plants and microorganisms. But what really makes them this tough? Their resiliency is in part due to a unique protein in their bodies called DESA, short for damage suppressor, that protects their DNA from being harmed by things like ionizing radiation, which is present in soil, water, and vegetation. Another amazing survival trick is cryptobiosis, a state of inactivity triggered by a dry environment. The micro-animals squeeze all the water out of their bodies, retract their heads and limbs, roll up into a little ball, and become dormant. When conditions improve, they unfurl themselves and go about their business. Mating and Reproduction Naturally, tardigrades have unusual mating habits. Depending on the species, the animals may reproduce asexually or sexually. In some species, males deposit sperm inside the cuticle of a molting, egg-carrying female during an hour-long mating process. Some females shed their cuticle and then lay their eggs inside to be fertilized later by males. Eggs take around 40 days to hatch, or as long as 90 days if they've been in a desiccated state. All the facts stated in this video is the reason why tardigrades are considered the most resilient species on planet Earth. If you made it to the end of the video, please hit that like and subscribe button. Thanks for watching!